Netflix wants to buy a professional sports league, but they don't want to pay for it. It recently came out that Netflix almost bought the World Surf League last year, but the two parties couldn't agree on a price. Reportedly, Netflix wants to buy a lower profile sports league outright to avoid the high cost of just purchasing their streaming rights. But I think they want to do it for an entirely different reason. The company has been in the running for the streaming rights to F1, the ATP Tennis Tour, and the Women's Tennis Association, but has backed out of all three of them, likely due to the high price tag. You see, live sports are becoming a huge lever of growth for other streaming services like Amazon Prime, Apple TV, and ESPN Plus, all of which have spent huge money in the last year to gain the rights to MLS, MLB, and the NFL. But it's not like Netflix doesn't have the content budget to compete for these leagues. Take Thursday Night Football, for example, which Amazon is paying $1.2 billion annually for the rights to. Netflix is committed to spending $17 billion annually on content in the coming years. So you think they could throw a little bit of that at live sports, seeing how successful they've been for platforms like Amazon. But I think Netflix holds itself in a higher esteem. It doesn't want to become just another channel you click through to watch a game. It wants to be a part of something more artistic and narrative driven. That's why I'm sure they really wanted the rights to stream F1.